how is it going guys this is british 1960 elizabeth ii five shillings or crown struck by a london mint great as proof 66 cameo by ngc vip issue with mintage of around 20 pieces overall very rare proof striking that's vital to the collections of British and Crown specialists in general. This lustrous vibrant gem radiates with a tremendous mirrored nature and subtle frosting to the devices. Sold for $10,200 at Stax Powers auction. Moving on to this Canadian coin featuring the second portrait of Queen Elizabeth II on obverse. Large date or large ship variety. Less than 2000s known. There are various versions of how 1969 large date variety came to exist. Some think the coin was struck in Philadelphia as a sample to show Canadian mint officials. Some think the coin was inadvertently struck from the retooled 1968 dies that were abandoned after the retooling process. The 1969 version look in need of a sharp facelift. In any event, the coin has become Canada's great modern rarity. This circulated nickel coin in AU58 grade ended up selling for $14,400 in 2019 at heritage auctions. This is 1965 Elizabeth II Type 2 Small Beads Blunt Dollar Coin in Mint State 64 Plus Blunt 5 Variety. Visual attractive with proof like gleam in the field, unusual amount of handling marks observed for the grade. Manufacturing problems with the Queen's new effigy led to a number of chains to the 1965 die sets. The first die design used was small beads variety. That design led to very poor die life, so it was fine-tuned. This obverse was paired with both reverse varieties to produce the first two overall varieties of the coin. Type 1 small beads pointed and type 2 small beads blunt. Sold on August 25th, 2019 for $18,000 at Heritage Auctions. And this is 1969 Elizabeth II, 25 cents from Canada, extremely rare mint error. Instead of nickel Canadian quarter planchette, it was struck over an English gold sovereign dated 1967 with original Elizabeth, readable above the bust. It weighs 7.98 grams, fully brilliant and possibly unique coins that ended up selling for $21,150 in 2014 at Heritage Auctions.